There are new developments in the dust up over the Obama administration spamming people with health care reform emails. The White House has confirmed to Fox News that it hired a private communications company to distribute the unsolicited mass emails. Fox's Eric Sean has been following the story, joins us on the phone now from New York. Eric, what's the latest? Yes, Shannon, as you said, the White House confirming to Fox News that it did use a government contractor to send out those David Axelrod emails that asked for support for the Obama administration health care plan. Very controversial issue sending out those emails. The company is called GovDelivery.com. It's based in Minnesota, started by a two 30-year-olds, and it happens to be uh, the largest, they claim, firm that sends out mass emails for the federal, state, and local governments around the country. They send out about 140 million emails a month from swine flu alerts to other issues. Uh, they boast, uh, by my count, Shannon, 11 cabinet agencies as clients, including the Department of Defense, State, Justice, uh, the ATF, the FBI, and even the IRS, but on their list, I could not find if they uh, claimed that a client was the executive office of the president, which is the White House. Well, we broke this story on Monday about the uh, suspicion that Gov Delivery was involved because Fox News viewers sent us their copies of the uh, Axelrod email that, uh, with some investigation, they said showed it came from Gov Delivery. Scott Burns, the president of Gov Delivery, refused comment, would have no comment on whether or not his firm sent those emails out to the White House. But now the White House admitting, yes, that Gov Delivery was used. They say that they only were used as an end product email distributor, uh, uh, obviously not having anything to do with the content, and they were hired after January 1st, but before January 20th. And they also point out that Gov Delivery does uh, uh, work for Republicans, such as Texas Governor Rick Perry and Indiana Governor Mitch Daniels. So, Shannon, I think a lot of the controversy centered on what, what role they could have been with this company. Now the White House saying yes. They used this company that is a massive government contractor to send out those David Axelrod emails. All right, there's the admission, and Eric Sean has been on it all along. Eric, uh, thank you very much for uh, joining us and, on Saturday. And Major, Major Garrett has uh, obviously been on this also, uh, and I'm sure the questions will continue. Absolutely. We uh, enjoyed his uh, tete a tete with uh, Mr. Gibbs in the uh, White House briefing that launched this whole thing. We thank you both for being on it. Right, Thanks, Shannon. Eric.